Hey guys, it's Nick, aka A1102021085, aka PC Hacker 11, and in this video I'm going to be reviewing two more themes for Windows Vista. I've done a lot of videos about themes for Windows Vista lately, and well, I just think they're cool, and whenever I find something new I want to share it with you guys, so anyway I'm going to be reviewing two more themes for Windows Vista, so I'm going to be reviewing the Windows 8 theme and the Max Clear theme. So, anyway, like always, you're going to need something to patch your system with for themes. Either use TuneUp Utilities 2009, Vista Glass, manually patch your system, or use something else for themes. But, uh, anyway, uh, it's the, I'm going to be reviewing the Windows 8 theme and the Max Clear theme. Now, uh, I'm sorry for running in classic mode right now. It's just I'm going to be applying both these themes, so... I'm running. I'm gonna start off in classic, but uh, anyway, uh, to download them, uh, I actually lost the download links for them, but I actually took them and uploaded them myself. So uh, if you want to download them, go up to my website, pchacker11.ucos.com, and then go over here to the site menu and click on the link that says Download Windows Themes. Now this basically has all the themes that I've made videos on in the past month, and the ones we're looking to download are the ones that says Max Clear and the one that says Windows 8. Just download both of these, and then they'll come up to these. So now let's go ahead and apply them. The one I'm going to apply first is the Max Clear theme. So let's go ahead and apply that. So uh, again, sorry for running in classic, but right now we're going to apply the Max Clear theme. So I'm going to click apply. And this is what it looks like when you're done. Now, as you notice, it's got this nice HD wallpaper with the with the sky, all the planets, the stars, the, the moon, clouds, and the meadow down here. And it's got a transparent taskbar. It's got the transparent taskbar. It's got the black starred orb. This is what the start menu looks like. And when we open up the windows, it's got the transparent windows up here. And it's got the uh, arrows for the windows, which is, you guys all know I like the arrows. So uh, that's the uh, Max Clear theme. So now let's go ahead and check out the Windows 8 theme. So I'm going to go ahead and apply the Windows 8 theme. So let's click Apply. Now here's the Windows 8 theme now. That is also a really cool wallpaper. I like that wallpaper. And uh, now let's go into some of the features of the theme. So if we go down into the taskbar at the bottom. It's got this cool start menu, which I like. This is what the start menu looks like. And it's got the uh, Windows 7-like taskbar down at the bottom. It's basically uh, an improvement of the Windows 7 theme. So uh, we click on this. It doesn't have the arrows up at the top here, but uh, it is uh, still, I like this theme. And I love that wallpaper, and I love the taskbar the way it is down here. And so, uh, anyway, this has been the Windows 8 theme and the Max Clear theme. So you can download them by going up to my website. I'll post a link to it in the description. Just click on the one that says Max Clear and the one that says Windows 8. Now, uh, they might not look like this in the future if you're watching this in the future, because I might add some more. But uh, just look for the one that says Max Clear and the one that says Windows 8. So anyway, that's the Windows 8 and the Max Clear theme. So uh, I think I'm going to go ahead and stick with the Max Clear theme for now, because uh, that seemed cool. So I think I'm going to apply that, because I liked it. So anyway... Thanks a lot for watching, you guys. This has been a video from A11021085. So uh, also check out my second channel, PC Hacker 11. And uh, I really need ideas for videos. If you guys want to send in an idea, a comment on this video, or send me an email at pchacker11 at gmail.com. Uh, if you guys want to see any kind of video Windows related, then please send in the idea to me. So anyway, thanks for watching, and I'll see you.